Hallelujah. Glory to God. Come on in. Everybody come on in. Come on in. Blessings. Hallelujah, Hello. hallelujah. Hi, everybody. Yes, yes. The Father, hallelujah, is doing great things for his people in these hallelujah. end times. Hallelujah. And we just enjoy what the Father is doing. Hallelujah. We would love for you to like, tag, and share. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, it's going to be a prophetic shift. On tonight, yes, God. Hallelujah! We give God's name the praise and the glory. Come on in, everybody. You all are welcome to join in Hallelujah. on tonight. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Blessings, Prophetess Lashawn. How you doing? Yes, blessings, Prophetess Seer yes, Lashawn. God bless you, Ashley. Hallelujah. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Thanks. Thank you for joining in on tonight. Oh my God! Hallelujah. Ooh. Hallelujah, hallelujah. As you guys come in, like, tag, and share. Yes, yes. And invite your followers. Um, let them know that, that we are live. Yes, yes. Don't want to miss this prophetic shift on tonight. The no. Father wants to shift some minds on tonight. Hallelujah. Getting ready to hear a word from the man of God when he come forward. Yes. God bless you, Prophetess Rice Milton. How yes. you doing? God bless yes. you. Yes. yes. Hallelujah. We give your name the praise and the glory, Father. But before we get started, yes. hallelujah, my husband going to bring forth the prayer. And after the prayer, we're going to bring forth the man of God because we don't yes. want to hold up the Holy Spirit on what he yes. needs to say yes. in this hour and this season for his people. Hallelujah. hallelujah. Hallelujah, Father, in the name of Jesus, we just want to thank Hallelujah. you. Hallelujah, thank you, Father. Hallelujah for, for allowing us once again to come together to hear Hallelujah. a thank word you, Lord. from you. Yes, God. Hallelujah, we pray, Father, you consecrate this life. Yes, Lord. Let your glory be revealed Hallelujah. on this life. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah, shift mindsets on tonight. Yes, God. Touch hearts on tonight in Hallelujah. the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah, Father, let the fire of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, flow on this live on tonight. Yes, Lord. Burn up everything and anything that's not of you. Thank you, Lord. Satan, you have no authority over this live. Hallelujah. We take full control on this live. We take authority yes, God. on this live. In the name of Hallelujah. Jesus. Satan, you have no access. We Hallelujah. decree and declare that Father, you consecrate yes, this life. Thank you, Lord. I lose all demonic activities. Hallelujah. All monetary spirits Hallelujah. must die by fire in yes, the Lord. spirit realm of tonight. Thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we pray, Father, Hallelujah. you let the man of God touch his mouth. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Let him speak what you have given him to speak. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. On tonight, on this night. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Father, now, we Father. pray. Yeah, you in Increase while we decrease. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Father, we love you. We adore you. We thank you for the people who's coming on this line. Yes, God. Hallelujah. We thank you, Father. Yes, God. For souls to be saved. We thank you. Hallelujah. For miraculous healing, come on, yes, miraculous God. deliverances, to yes, come Lord, forth. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, thank you, Lord God, we pray, yes, Lord, Ooh. my God, yes, Lord, Hallelujah, yes, Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, man of God, man of God, yes, God. Grove. yes, Lord, what well, we ready, <laughs> we ready to bring you yes, on, yes, Lord, Hallelujah, 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 yes, Hallelujah, thank you, Lord, bless your holy name, yes, yes, yes. Hallelujah, yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Yes, God. Thank you, Lord God. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Grace and peace to you all. 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 Grace and peace Thank you, Lord. So, so can can you all hear me well? Can yes, 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 yes. Wonderful. Yes, so you got the me? floor. So can you I got the floor. Okay. Down the Holy Ghost. So we listen. got it tonight. We got it. We got it. We ready for you to shift the minds. Yes, Lord. So listen, grace and peace to everybody. I thank God tonight for the man and the woman of God. Yes. yes. Thank you for sharing your platform and allowing me to come yes. and say what it is that the Lord allowed me to say. So listen. I'm going to get started. I promise you, I'm not going to be long. Flow with since the spirit this, is a, of God, man. since this is a prophetic shift, I literally I feel a, a prophetic shift tonight. So as I was in prayer earlier, this is what the Lord released to me. The word of the Lord said, we're in the season of the remnant arising. Ooh, 
And he said, and when you look up the word remnant, it simply means the remaining. Jesus. You missed it. So the Lord said, I'm literally about to cause the remaining to arise. Ooh. Those that have been seeking my face and those Jesus. that have been hidden and those that aren't seeking platforms, however they're seeking my power. He said, I am about to raise up the remaining, likened uh, to David in 1 Samuel chapter 16. Yeah. He was the remnant one, however, he understood elevation came from serving. Can I stop long enough Ooh. just to let you know there are many of you, you feel like you've been overlooked, you feel like people have been rejected you you feel like God is elevating everybody else oh and he has God. forgot about you but I came to release this word to you tonight that God says that, that I'm raising up the remedy can y'all do me a favor like share tag and, yes, Lord. It, and let's Hallelujah. get at least 25 to 30 people in this room yes on Lord. Tonight because this word is for the remnant ones I literally hear in my spirit that the Lord said I'm literally raising up the remedy and I said God what do you mean because you know in the church we often throw around the word remnant this remnant this remnant this but yes. God I said, I'm literally positioning my church for the remnant to come forth. Many of the remnant have been hidden. Oh my Many God. Many of the remnant have been looked over. Ooh. But God says, I'm literally about to raise up the remnant. Listen, can I just be honest and very transparent with you all? You got a lot of folks that are anointed and they really don't want to walk in the anointed because of rejection, because of folks backbiting, Ooh. because of folks misunderstanding Ooh. them. Hey, can I just, can I? Hey. Okay. Can, can, can I just be very honest? I'm afraid for folks that want to be prophets, but don't want to be processed. Oh, that's a word. That's right. That that went that went over some of I'm afraid. I'm afraid for prophets that want to people that want to be prophets and don't want to be processed. So listen, listen to what the word of the Lord said to me. He said, He said, I am about to raise up the remaining, like it done to David in first century 16. He was a remnant one, however, he understood elevation came from serving. Watch this. Many of you feel overlooked, you feel rejected. However, God said, I'm about to bless you because you remain posh. Oh my God. Yes, Lord. Jesus. That, 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 that was heavy. Oh, he said, God. I'm about to bless you yes, because Lord. you remain postured. Can I talk to the people of God tonight? You've been postured for purpose. You've been postured for power. You've been postured for anointing. And I know you're saying, God, I hear this. I hear the ribbon that is rising. But God, what do you do when you're anointed and people don't want to celebrate you? What huh? do you do when you're God, anointed God. and yes, people Lord. don't want to invite you here? Is what I'm saying to you. In First Samuel chapter 16, watch this. David understood his anointing, but he did not get out of position. Uh oh, oh come on, talk back about it up. It. Let me try it again. David understood it. his anointing, but he did not get out of position. He was not jealous of the other brothers that were in the house because he understood his time was coming. Can I just tell you this? Jesus. Tonight? You better stay planted and you better stay posted because sooner or later your time is coming. Can I prophesy? to everybody on this live tonight and let you know that it's your time and your turn. You've been faithful, yes, Lord, yeah, God. of the few God. things. So God says, now I'm about to make you ruler over many. Watch this. Let me talk to you tonight because watch this. David, he understood when you read the text. And see, this is just a little Sunday school scripture. When you read the text in 1 Samuel chapter 16, Jesse gave David an assignment. He said, go down there and maintain the sheep. Can I tell you something here tonight? That elevation come from the small stuff. Come on, Greg. Yes. Yeah. Can I, say, can, can, can I say it again? Elevation comes from the small stuff. And watch this, Apostle Ross. Here it is. David submitted to his daddy's voice. Can I tell you something here tonight? You better watch out for all these illegal voices that are trying to elevate you and that are trying to tell you that God called you to something. And you know yourself, you're not called to it. David understood his daddy's voice. Can I tell you tonight? God, God said in this Ooh, season that God. you're in, you can't let everybody's voice validates you can tell you something in this hour and in this season god said i'm elevating the pure remedy yes said, i'm elevating those that have been pure that oh my god, god. those yes, god. that say listen yes lord to your will yes to your way all i'm trying to tell you tonight is in this season god says i'm elevating the remedy watch this yes god so watch this. He, he, he gave me a lot. He downloaded a lot to yes, me Lord. for this live. So, so watch this. He said, he said, uh, 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 don't let rejection get you out of position. Woo, Jesus. M m many of you allow rejection to get you out of position because you feel like, oh, they ain't choosing me. Or, uh -oh. oh, they chose 
they chose us to sue over me. Oh, but can God. I tell you something here today? Just because they chose them, that don't mean God chose them. Right. The Bible says right. it like oh, this. Yes, the Lord. Bible says many are called, but few, few. are chosen. Can I talk Jeez. to you tonight and let you understand? If you celebrate everybody else, let me tell you something. Yes, God. God ain't got no problem with elevating you. Here is what David did. David, <laughs> in the midst of God, elevated his brothers. Watch this. David still rejoice. Can I tell hey, God. you something? Here today, you ain't got time to pick, oh God, pick on folk and slander folk name because God elevated them. Let me say something. Yo. You don't know what they went through privately hey. for the elevation to happen publicly. So watch this. Come and hang out with me for a little while. Ooh. We got a long way to go and a short time to get there. Yes, Here's what I'm saying. God said in this season, I'm getting ready to elevate the ones that don't mind suffering. God said, oh, that, I'm getting ready to God. elevate the ones yes, that don't mind crying. God said, she she I'm elevating my yes. heart. He said, I'm elevating the ones that don't mind sacrifice. I ain't got nothing but Bible for you. Yeah, Isaiah chapter 40, verse 31 says it like this, Alexis Armstrong. They that wait upon the Lord, yes, Lord. shall renew their strength. Yeah, Can yeah. I talk to those tonight and let you know that you don't know the suffering that I had to go through privately to get elevated public, publicly? Well, I ain't got nothing but Bible for you. The Bible says it like this, after you have suffered a while. Yeah. yeah. My God. Yeah, yeah. He says, I will strengthen you. He says, I will settle you. And then he says, says, I will establish you. Here it is. Watch this. And here's your shout. Don't miss it, apostle. Don't miss it. He said, because watch this. Many people want platforms, but they don't want power. Woo! Say that. I you better talk, say, I just said something. And it went over y'all. A lot of you all want platforms, but you don't want power. So here's the truth of the matter. Before David got the platform, he already had the power. I know y'all say David is anointed, but can I, oh God, can I just, can I have my way tonight, please? Yes, Lord. Watch this, okay, watch this, because watch this, we always like to talk about the anointed David, but let's talk about the David that had faults, that had failures, let's talk about the David that messed up, let's talk about the David that slept with somebody else's wife, had her husband oh. on the front lines to get killed, yeah, let's talk, let's talk about that David, let's talk about the David, yes, Lord, that seen a woman uh, bathing herself outside on the king's roof, let's talk about that David, all I'm trying to tell you is, guess what, uh, although you fail, Although you were full of fault, uh, sin, guess what? That does not take the hand of God off of your life. Watch this. All I'm trying to tell you is your past does not disqualify you from God using you. Well, guess what? That was the same David that said in Psalm 51 10, Lord, created me a clean yes, heart. Lord, yes, and yeah. renew the right spirit within me, oh God. Yes, Can I tell God I feel yes, Lord. That was the same David, yes, Lord, that said in Psalm 51, Lord, don't take your presence yeah, away yeah. from me. I know I'm God, filthy. I know I'm messed up. I know I committed sin. But Lord, don't take your spirit you away from me. Can I talk, God? Help me. Can I talk to you tonight and let you know that before we experience real revival, we got to experience real repentance? Oh, oh my God. You talk about that, brother. Talk God. about that. You missed it. Before we experience real revival, we got to experience real repentance. I know. I know y'all saying, uh, well, prophet so-and-so said revival is coming. Apostle so-and-so said revival is coming. I believe revival is coming, true enough. Uh, but God said, I need the body of Christ to repent. Watch this. Uh, not just the pulpit, but the pews. Woo! Can I tell you something here tonight? Because we always want to blame the pulpit. We always want to talk about the pulpit. Yes. We always want to slander the pulpit. But let me help you get delivered from y'all that's throwing stones at the pulpit. Take a chance to check the pew. Take a a chance to examine the pew because guess what? There's some folk in the pew that's dirty too. Yeah, come on here. Yes, right. Lord. All right. Come watch, on. Yes, right. Come let, on let, here. Let, 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 let me get back to this. Watch this. So watch this. Uh, don't let rejection get you out of position. But then watch this, Apostle Nina. Watch this. He says, this is, this is, God said, I'm raising up those that have been postured for purpose. But then he says, watch this. I know you don't understand. It. Yes, God. I know you're frustrated, but God said, I'm about to raise up some people who you don't know. My God, come on. Who you, who, who, you, who you don't know, who you 
haven't seen, who you haven't heard of, who are not popular, but they are powerful. Oh, oh my Ooh. God, say that again. Oh, my God. I'm God to... said, I'm raising up people who aren't popular, but they are powerful. I know you want the ones that got the entourage. I know you want the ones that got the limousine. I know you want the ones that got the private But God said, no, I'm getting ready to raise up some people that have been processed. God said, I'm getting ready to raise up some folk. Yes, Lord. Jesus Christ, I feel a shift happening in the earth yeah, now. God. He said, I'm getting ready to raise up some people, yes, Lord, who you don't know, who you haven't seen, who you ain't been connected with. Can I tell you something here tonight? God said, I am about to raise up some people in the body of Christ who got my word in their mouth. Can yeah. I tell you something? Yeah. They ain't worried about an honorarium. I wish I had a witness yes, Lord. They ain't worried about an honorarium, but all they want to do is see souls saved. Can somebody do me a favor and type in a comment and, and just write in the comment, I'm postured for purpose. My God, I'm postured for purpose. I'm postured for purpose. I'm postured for purpose. Postured, for purpose. postured. watch this. Huh? Watch yeah, this. Whole shot. He, 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 here it is. Yes, Lord. This, this is the season. This is the season of the postured one. Woo! Let's go. Come on, let me help you. This is the season of the postured ones. This is the season for the ones that say, Lord, I'm going to stay postured. Although I don't like the process. Although uh, although the pain don't feel good, Lord, I'm still going to stay postured. God, although yes. the affliction is uncomfortable, I'm still going to stay postured. God, Ooh, although, yes, Lord. Although, the, although the attack does not feel good, yes, Lord. I'm still going to stay postured. God, although I know people are scandalizing my name, Lord, I'm still oh. going to stay postured. Oh. God, although, although Madison Skinner, I got a thorn in my side. Come here. Paul, I'm still going to stay postured. Can I tell you what the Apostle Paul said? He went to God about his thorn three times. He said, Lord, take the thorn out of my side. But can I tell you something here tonight? Here, here's what Jesus told Paul. Jesus said, listen, my grace is sufficient. Yeah, yeah. All right, y'all. Y'all don't want to have no church. Oh, said, my God. He said, grace, he said, my grace. He said, my grace. He said, my grace is sufficient. So watch this. Yes, Lord. Watch this. He, he says, <laughs> he says, watch this. He says, after David... Got anointed as king, he went back to his original original position. Watch this, don't miss it. He went back to his original position. He didn't let his call make him cocky, but he was just confident. Yeah. Oh, 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 my God. I'm, I may get in trouble. But let me say it again. He did not let his call make him cocky, but he, he just knew he was confident. Can I talk to y'all leaders that want to be cocky? You want to act like you're not replaceable? Let me tell you something. God said tonight, you are replaceable. Because oh! you know, I know the, I know the, I know I know the pain died. And I, I know y'all talking about the changing of the guards and this, that, the third. But can I tell you something tonight? No, you're missing. The changing of the guards been happening. Oh! But can I tell you something? You overlooked it because it's not your favorite one. You overlooked Looked at because all right, all right. you about to make me throw my phone pocket. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm just saying because the truth of the matter is we missed it. Oh, why is it that when somebody did die, we want to talk about the changing of the gods? Oh. We missed it. We it, missed it. My God, the, the the changing of the gods has been happening. There you go, right there, big Paul. Come on here. But because. It's not our favorite. Ah! We don't want to listen to it. My God. But God. Oh my gosh. Hey, my boy. Somebody else. But God said tonight, what I'm doing is I'm shifting the body. Hey! Yes, Lord. Hey! My to a place, to a place, God, give me strength and I'll be your prophet. He said, I'm shifting the body to a place of repentance and to a place of acceptance because the truth of the matter is we don't want to accept what God is doing in this hour. But as I was in prayer, the Lord literally began to speak to me. He literally said, tell my people tonight, what I'm doing is I'm doing a shifting. Watch this. Not in the pulpit, but in the pew. God said, I'm shifting the pew my because God. the pew, the pew has fallen asleep. Not the pulpit, the pew has fallen asleep. The pew has gotten comfortable. Can I tell you what the Lord said? The Lord said, ask this question tonight. Where are the intercessors in the pew? Uh-oh. 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 Prophet. Uh-oh. Prophet. Uh-uh. Prophet. Uh -uh. Talk about it. I mean, I, 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 may, I may get in trouble. But, a couple of people but, but, over here tonight. But here's the thing. 
what other intercessors in the pew? You know, we want to blame the preacher for not praying. We want to blame the prophet for not praying. But tonight, I need to challenge you, where is the intercessors in the pew? Because the truth of the matter is, the preacher ain't able to see everything. The prophet not able to see everything. But David said, I'd rather be a doorkeeper in the house of my God. That's what the that Bible that says. Lord. He said, I'd rather be a doorkeeper in the house of my God Jesus. than to dwell in the tent of the wicked. Since this is a prophetic shift, let me shift you tonight. Yes, Lord. You need to open up your mouth to get to say what you see. Because the truth of the matter is the reason why the body of Christ is under attack. Because the folks in the pew are not saying what they see. Can I tell you something here tonight? All right. All right. All right. My God. My God. See, so the truth ah, of the, 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 the truth. Yes, the truth, the truth, the truth of the matter Thank is this. Thank you. Honey. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this, apostles. Let me bless y'all tonight. Mm. I'm gonna bless y'all and help about 30 other folk that have watched the replay. And I'm a, and I'm gonna bless the one that's outside watching too because they don't want to come in. You can't you can't expect everybody to understand your anointing. No. Oh. Uh oh. Say that again. You, you, you can't. You can't expect everybody to understand your anointing, oh. but then watch this. You can't expect everybody to understand your assignment because please do do understand this. Can I help you tonight? Can, can I help you? Do understand this. Whenever God places an assignment on your life, there is always an assassin somewhere near. Oh, oh my God. Prophet. Oh, my God. I just blessed my about 30 people. And a dog named Rufus. You got to understand. Everybody will not understand your assignment. <sighs> Ooh, my God. Prophet. My God. Because truth of the matter is this. Just because they're connected to you. Can, can I say it? God. That does not mean oh, that babe. they're covering you. That, that, just, just because just because they're connected to you, that does not mean that they're covering you. Oh. I'm gonna give my own self. I'm gonna give my own self an offering tonight. Come on. <laughs> just because they're connected to you, that oh. does not mean they're covering you. Because oh. guess what? You now, now, and Lord, I'm, I'm just gonna go with God. Now you got a lot of folk that want to be in covenant with you, but yet they're stabbing you. If you don't talk, sir. Come on. You can't you 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 can't be in covenant with me yeah, and stab me. Can, can, can I talk? Ooh, can I talk? Jesus. Be, 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 because the truth, the truth of the matter is this the Bible says know them that lay among us. Come on you. here. This may be a little heavy for some of y'all tonight, uh -uh. but you, but you need this tonight. Yeah. Because the truth of the matter is, the reason why some of y'all are in the cave is because of some folk that you're connected to, and the reason why some of y'all are experiencing the favor of God on your life is because of who you're connected to. But God said tonight, I came to expose the assassin so you can fulfill the assignment. Whoa! 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 I'm, Jesus! I'm talking tonight. My God, you walk in heaven, sir. Talk on. So watch this. Watch this. My God. Because in, in, in this season that you're in, you have to protect your anointing and also protect your assignment. Yes, Lord. Yes. Can, can I give it to you again? Can I give it to you again? You have to protect your anointing and protect your assignment. Yeah. Yes, God. Watch this. You can't let everybody pour into you. You can't you can't let everybody pour into you. All right. Let me make it make sense. Yes. Some of y'all looking confused. Yes. Watch this. When you have when you're pregnant, let me talk to the mothers. Oh. When you're pregnant, that you don't let everybody touch your womb. I'm a living witness, prophet. Come on here. Because of what you're carrying. Huh? Let me flip it. Let me flip it to the spiritual. When you are anointed and you're getting ready to walk in your call, you don't let everybody lay hands Woo! on you. Woo! Come on. Yes, Lord. Hey, God. Because there are folks with dirty hands. <laughs> My God. God give me strength to see. Y'all need to see. You got you 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 you, 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 you you got a lot of folk with dirty hands. My God. Heart touch. 
but the truth of the he says he says i'm causing a purity to hit the fire cold because the truth of the all right that's it right there come on you in the vein sir yes lord because because the truth because the truth of the matter is this the reason why some of you all on experience experiencing elevation huh? which you're gonna get up off in the night the reason why some of y'all are experiencing elevation is because of the ones who imparted into you Woo! and it's causing your oil to be tainted can i tell you <laughs> can i tell you tonight Ooh. watch this can i tell you the bible says <sighs> that the oil flowed from the head hey! down that's, that's the it. word that's the word that's the word my god so if you got if you got a contaminated head, huh? come, come, come here. Talk about Come here. Come here. Talk about if you it. You got a contaminated head. Mm -hmm. Trust and believe you're going to have a contaminated body. Uh huh. Break some yokes tonight. Yes, Lord. Yes, but the truth, but the truth, hmm. my God. But the truth of the matter is this a lot of us, the reason why God. I feel power. Hey, the reason why God has not did what it is that what that He said He was going to do in Bible times is because the body of Christ have got so distracted. We have lost our focus. We have lost Ooh. our focus. I was in prayer today, and the Lord literally said to me, He said, "Son, I'm getting ready to get my church back on focus." Watch this. He said, "My bride has gotten distracted." Oh. He, 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 he said, he said, he said, my bride has gotten distraction. I said, Lord, what, what, what do you mean my, your bride has gotten distracted? He said, some because the small stuff, he said, it, 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 it's snatching the focus away. You got folk that's trying to uh, uh, commit suicide. Yeah. The, the Lord said, I'm literally causing my church to get back on focus. So watch this. My watch this. You can't reveal your anointing or assignment to people prematurely. Uh oh, oh! Please say that again. Oh, Jesus. you can't. You can't reveal your anointing <laughs> or your assignment to people prematurely. Because watch this. My God. Everybody ain't gonna celebrate you. Come That's on, right. Man. That's right. Come, Come on, man. Man. If, if, if Everybody is not gonna celebrate with you. Everybody is not gonna push you. Because watch this. Some people want to see you fail. Yes. Yeah. Come on here. Some people some people want to see you fall. But the Bible says it like this. He said, Be still and know that I am God. My God. Here's the truth of the matter. That until the church gets back to the basics, my God, yes, Lord. We are never see the hand of God. Oh my God. Watch this. Revelation chapter 3. Let me tell you what Revelation chapter 3 says. Revelation <laughs> chapter 3. Yes, Lord. Have your way from me. My God. I'm coming. I'm coming. Just, just hang out. Take your time. Pray. Reve my God. Re my Revelation chapter 3. Yes, Lord. Revelation chapter 3 said it like this. He said in verse number 8. I know that works. Mm, 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 mm. He said, behold, I have set before thee an open door. Yeah. And no man can shut it. Here it is. Yes, sir. for thou hast a little strength and has kept my word and has not denied my name. Duh. Listen to what verse, listen to what verse number 11 said. Behold, I come quickly. Yes. Yes, Lord. Hold that fires which thou hast. Yes. That no man take thy crown. Can I tell you something here tonight? Can't nobody take what God then gave you. I don't care how many folk try to dismantle you. I don't care how many folk try to put a word curse on you. What God has given you, can't no man. I'm Come on, Come can't, on. Can't, 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 can't no man. Can't no man, yes, can't, can't, can't no man take it away. But here it is. Yes, God. Hold on. Let's go back real fast because this is going to shout you. Revelation chapter 2 mm -hmm. said it like this. Number 11, he said, He that hath an ear, yeah, let him hear what the spirit says unto the church. Here it is, yes, Lord. The church is missing it because our 
ears are literally full of wax. And so God said, I'm literally taking a spiritual Q-tip and I'm literally cleaning the mess out of the Woo! ears so I can allow so I can allow the people of God to hear me so clearly. But the truth of the matter is this, Apostle, that we have gotten so caught up in performance in church. We want to see performances. Yeah. But God is saying, in this season that I'm in, this season that you're in, he said, I'm purifying the body from the pulpit to the people. Yes, Woo! Lord. Come on here. Yes, Lord. So, so watch this. Uh, watch this. Because here it is. Truth of the matter is this, Apostle. We want God. But when was the last time we gave ourselves back to God? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh my God! Uh oh. Mm, 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 mm. When was the when was the last time that you renewed your commitment? Oh my God, Jesus, Jesus! When was the last time you renewed your yes to God? My God. When, 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 when was the last time that you said yes, Lord, to Your will? Yes, yes to Your way. When when was the last time? My God. That you just said, Lord, whatever you want me to do, I'll do it. Yes, Lord. Because because the truth, because here's the truth of the matter. Watch this. Yes, Lord. Are, are y'all ready for this? Yes. Here's the truth of the matter. Truth of the matter is this, that a lot of us, the reason why God is not elevating us, because we won't disconnect from folks. Ooh. If you don't speak Holy Ghost, my God, my God. The reason why. Let these people know, Father, so they won't think we just blowing smoke over here. Come on. The, the, re the reason why God will not elevate some of us is because we won't disconnect from folks. My God. Ooh. I ain't got nothing but Bible for y'all. Come on here. Second, Second Timothy chapter 3. Yes, Lord. Watch Speak this. Holy Ghost. Watch this. Second Timothy chapter 3 says, but know this, that in the last days, uh -huh. perilous times will come. Yes. Yeah. For men will become lovers of themselves, mm. lovers of money, boasters, yeah. blasphemers. Here it is: disobedient to parents, unthankful, unholy, unloving, unforgiving, slanders, without self-control. See, this is a lot to deal with. But watch the self-control: uh, bu uh, brutal, despising of good, traitors, headstrong, haughty, lovers of pleasure rather than lovers of God. Here's verse five: having a form of godliness. Is, is that what y'all Bible says? Yeah. yeah. I mean, a form of godliness. Come on. Yes. It's power. And from such turn away. For of this sort <laughs> are those who crept into households and made captive. Uh huh. My, 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 my. Jesus. Can I tell you something here tonight? I feel power. Yes. Can I tell you something here tonight? That that's what's really going on in the body of Christ now. We've allowed these things to creep into the pulpit, and we we don't really want to uh, expose them. But the Bible says, "Mark those that cause division." Oh, oh my God! My God! My God. <laughs> All right, my my, All right. my God, yes, Lord. <laughs> Let me tell you what the Message Bible says. Same scripture. Mark yeah, the Message Bible. Woo. It's gonna shout you. <laughs> don't be naive. Uh huh. <laughs> the Message Bible puts it so plain. Don't be naive. There are difficult times ahead. As the end approaches, people are going to be self-absorbed, self money-hungry, self-promoting, stuck Ooh, up. Oh, my God. Profane, contemporaries of parents, crude, coarse, dog-eat-dog, dog, unbending, slanders, impulsively wild, savage. Here it is, treacherous, ruthless, Bloated windbags, addicted to lust, and allergic to God. <laughs> Woo! I'm not done. Here's the last part. They'll make a show of religion. Oh, oh. yes, Lord. Mm -hmm. But behind the scenes, they're animals. Woo! Brutal animals. Listen, listen to what Paul told Peter. Woo. I mean, Paul told Timothy. He said, stay clear of these people. My yeah. God. He says, these are the kind of people who smooth talk themselves uh -huh. into the homes of unstable and needy women and take advantage of them. Women who, depressed by the sinfulness, take up with every new religious fad that calls itself truth, they get exploded every time and never really learn. These men are like those old Egyptian frogs. My God, Jesus. Watch this. He says, they were rejects from the faith twisted in their thinking, defying truth itself, but nothing will come of these latest impostors 
everyone will see through them just as people saw through that Egypt, that Egyptian hope. My God. Watch this. Here it is. Here, here's the warning. Stay clear of folk like that. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. That's it. Hey. Because truth, because, because truth of the matter is this. A lot of us are getting connected to the wrong people. Whoa. A, gar a, 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 a garment medicine scanner, a garment don't make you powerful. Mm -hmm. uh, Prophet is read, watch this. A collar don't make you powerful. Come on, oh. here. Come on here. Come on. A clergy ring don't make you powerful. Come on. But here's the truth of the matter. I'd rather have jeans and a shirt and an anointing than have a clean garment and a dirty heart. Come on. Come Hallelujah. on. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Got a lot of folks that got clean garments and dirty hearts. Dirty hearts. My God. Can church. I tell you tonight? Can I tell you tonight? Can I tell you tonight? I feel power. Yes, Lord. Let me tell you, let me tell you this tonight. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes. There's going to be a lot of folks Woo. that think they're going to heaven. Woo. But they're really going to bust hell wide open. Yes, Lord. Yep, Lord. You 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 think he's going to say, "Well done, that good and faithful servant." My God. But really, he's going to say, "Depart from me, yes. Woo! you workers Jesus. of iniquity." I knew you not. He, he, here's the prophetic shift. What the Lord is saying, mm. Prophet uh, Wakefield, he said, "In this season that I'm that you're in, he said, I'm raising up a remnant of people that are sound their alone." Yes, Lord. Jesus. Yes, God. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Am I, I released to prophesy to a few people? Because that's what I see. Flow, flow, flow. Okay. Flow, Wonderful. Flow. Don't Watch this. Flow. E Ebony Wakefield, the spirit of grace, told me to tell you that you're in the season of prophetic utterance. Oh. He said, Prophet Wakefield, that you're getting ready to begin to prophesy like never before. My. And the Lord said, even interpretation of dreams shall be your portion. <laughs> Prophet Wakefield, the spirit of grace told me to tell you the gift of healing is in your hands. Oh. Prophet Wakefield, my this, my God. Hey, Prophet my Wakefield, God. the spirit of grace see. told me to tell you. He said, yes, Lord. He said, I'm opening, he said, I'm opening your hey. eyes and I'm giving you the eyes of the seer. Yes, yes Lord. Lord. Prophet is Wakefield, he said, I'm giving you the eyes of the seer. For yea, woman of God, you have been on the back burner for too long. You have been looked over. You've been celebrating everybody else, Prophet is Wakefield. But the Lord said, I am about to elevate you in this next season yes. of your life. Woman of God, hey. for I see you writing. I see you mm -hmm. sitting at a table and I see you writing. For I heard the spirit of grace say, Prophet is Wakefield. He said, write the vision and make it plain. Mm, 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 mm. Yes, Lord. Yes, Prophet is Wakefield, for there's literally like a writer's anointing that's mm, mm, for the mm, enemy mm. has tried to put writer's block on you for the past two and a half, Woo! three years. But the Lord said today, I'm taking the writer's block off you. Prophet is Wakefield, I see the Lord. Hey, my rabbi. Literally, mm, God, I feel the anointing of the prophet. He says, I'm literally opening a door for you in Texas. I literally see you, prophet is with you, walking through a door in Texas. It's literally like I see Houston, Texas. I see the Lord opening a door for you in Texas. Prophet is Wakefield is literally like I see the Lord creating a door for you because it's literally like there was a door that was supposed to belong to you and somebody tried to back door you but oh. I literally heard the Lord say I am about to mm, I'm about to create a door for you <laughs> so, so prophet is Wakefield this is the season that God says your mouth is about to give you your miracle yes Lord for what I literally oh my God. see wow. Jesus. Wow. Wow. Jesus. Wow. Jesus. Yes. But I literally, for I, yes, for Ooh, I literally Lord. see Prophet is Wakefield. I see some paperwork. I see like some paperwork. And I heard the Lord say he's shifting the paperwork. My ah. yeah, Ah, but I'm telling you tonight, mm, I'm telling you tonight, I see, yes, this is the season mm. of a certain shift. Yes. Woo! Jesus. Wait, do y'all, 
Wait, do y'all see what she said? Contracts. Yes. Yes. All right. Come on. And y'all, let, let, now let me just say this for the, for those that are eavesdropping in the room. They ain't told me nothing. Come on here. I, I, you know, I'm just, I just had to put that out there because, you know, eavesdropping. Uh-huh. So, 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 so Prophet is Wakefield. <laughs> there you go. Pro Prophet is Wakefield. There's literally like a six-figure anointing that's on Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, yes, my Lord. Lord. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 There's literally Prophet's Wakefield, a six-figure anointing that's on you. And it's, it's literally like I see three businesses coming out of your loan. Ooh, Jesus. My God. Bless your name, Father. Yes, Lord. 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 Yes, Yes, Lord. 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 Mm -hmm. You have the grace, you have the grace to gather. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, 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 prop my sister, hey, to my God. Yes, hallelujah. Prophet is Wakefield, I need to speak to your body. Uh oh, mm -hmm. yes, mm -hmm. yes, I command the attack to go back to where it came from. My God. Because it's literally like Prophet is Wakefield. You have been in a place. Yes. Mm. I'm saying, God, I just don't know. Ah! Oh my God. Hallelujah. But you've been postured. My God. Yes, Lord. For purpose yes lord oh my so, god so tonight so tonight whoa yes whoa lord. jesus mm -hmm. jesus my god my god jesus yeah. whoa. yes sir. very strange season yes lord but tonight th th this word is for the chosen one. Mm. Yes, Lord. The ones uh, that say, Lord, I don't understand. Ah! My God, yes, God. Hallelujah. Jesus, yes, Lord. Say, Lord, it, it, it just don't make, make sense. sense. It don't make sense. I'm on. Yes, Lord. Oh, Jesus. You know, David said, David said, they just so in tears. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Lord. Shall reap and joy. reap and joy. Yeah. Yes, Lord. yes God. We're in our reaping season. Yes, Father. My, my, let me tell you what. Let me tell you my favorite scripture. Galatians six and nine says it like this: "And let us not be weary." <laughs> Come on. And well doing. <laughs> For yes, Lord. That's me. <laughs> You yes, Lord. That's it. Lose. 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 My okay, I, I, I came to speak a word to about 25 of you tonight yes, Lord. and let you know that you're in your due season. Yes, yes, Lord. God owes you this one. Yes, he literally, yes, oh, Joel chapter 2 said, mm -hmm. I will restore unto you yeah. the years that the locusts, the canker worm, and the crumb worm have destroyed. Job 42 10 said that when Job prayed for his friends, the Lord gave him twice as much as he had before. Ooh, Lord, yes, God. You're in your due season. Yes, God. Hallelujah. He owes you this one. Oh, my yes. God. Jesus. He, oh, he, literally, he literally owes you this one. So yes. tonight, I want, to, I want to release over this live over everybody that's watching.
I want to release an anointing of do on you. Yes, want to release an anointing of do on you. What what do I mean? I want to release an anointing of God owing you this. Yes, God. My God. An anointing of payback. I want to release that on you. In the name Thank of you, Jesus. Lord. Thank you, Lord. So tonight, Father, bless everyone that watched this live tonight. Yes, God, do it now. God, bless, bless everyone that heard the word on tonight. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus, I decree, God, that you bless that going, God, and that coming in. Father, I yes, just want declare tonight, God, Deuteronomy 28 over your people. Yes, bless Lord. Shall they be in the city. Bless shall they be in the field. Blessed shall they be going out. Blessed shall they be coming in. In the name of Jesus. Father, I decree and I declare tonight, God, the anointing of expansion will hit oh, the lost family. Yeah, in the name of Thank Jesus. You. Father, I decree, God, the anointing of expansion will hit the lost family and their <laughs> ministry. In the name <laughs> of <laughs> Jesus, Father, expand that ministry. In the name <laughs> of <laughs> Jesus, God. God, put favor on them. God, put favor on them in Mississippi. In the name of Jesus. Ooh, my God. My God. Father, thank you for their ministry. Thank you for their life. Thank you for what you're getting ready to do. In the name of Jesus. Father, I bless them. In the name of Jesus. Yes, I thank Lord. you that it is so. Yes, Lord. so it is. In Jesus' name. Somebody just send up heart and give God a praise on tonight. Yes, Lord. Oh, Lord. Send up some hearts and give God give God a praise tonight for what he has done. I promise you the Lord, the Lord has released something in this earth tonight. Yes, Lord. Thank you tonight for the opportunity for allowing me to share what it is. The Lord. All right. Yes, Lord. All right. Who is Milton? The Milton Woman of God, the God. I don't want to mess up her name. Uh, trend, 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 somebody, the woman of God. Right, Milton. Yes. Mm -hmm. Is she still on here? Yes, she's still on, on, on here. Mm -hmm. Woman of God, let me tell you, the muzzle is being taken off of your mouth. <laughs> Rice right, Milton, let me tell you. People in religious religious aspects have tried to muzzle your mouth because of denomination and because of Whoa. where you came from, your background. But God said he's taken the muzzle off of your mouth and he's sending it to fire your way. Yes, and, he's also and he's also releasing the wind of the revivalist. Mm -hmm. Right, Milton, there's a revivalist that's locked up on the inside of you. That the spirit of grace that I'm causing to come forward. There's also like an intercessor that's down on the inside of you. Yes, Lord. And God said tonight, there's got to come forward. Mm. And it is so. And so it is in Jesus' name. Yes, Blessings on you. I'm done. Back in your hands, Apostle. Thank you. God bless you, Prophet. We we thank we thank the Father for you accepting this this call on the on the live tonight. Oh, Lord, Father, Lord, 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 Continue to open up more doors for the man of God to come yes, forward, yes. to be a sound, to be a beacon yes. in the kingdom, oh God, the kingdom oh, of life. Oh, Father, continue to raise him up to yes. bring even terror to the kingdom yes. of darkness. Yes. Father, we thank you for elevating him to a new dimension in yes. you. Oh, Father, we thank you, Father, that he shall have more increase, yes. for he shall have more, Father, that he would not have room enough to even receive it, oh God. Oh, we thank you yes. for the man of God, Father, yes. and we just cover him, oh God, yes. on tonight. And if so, and the blood of Jesus cover your yes. mind, hallelujah. If anybody would like to sow into this man of God, oh my God, he is He's a pure vessel on tonight. Pure vessel. spirit led, I pinned his cash up at the bottom. 
Please sow into the man of God if you are spearing there. Some need to be sowing, hallelujah, for their harvest season. Some hallelujah. of you need to be planting, hallelujah, your seed for this next season, this next open door that shall swing yes, open. Yes. Some of y'all need to be uh, right now producing Woo. your seed right now, putting your seed in the ground so your harvest can come forward in this new season Ooh. that we are getting ready to walk apart. I'm telling you, if you get your seed in the ground, I'm telling you, God is doing things suddenly. Yes. Hallelujah. He's doing things suddenly. Hallelujah. In this hour and in this season. Hallelujah. Let, 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 me, let me say this, <clears throat> and I promise you, I, I, uh -oh, flow, 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 man. Of God. We, we, we didn't flow. talk about this, but there is at least 10 of you tonight. I challenge you to sow a seed of $40. I'm telling you, there are 10 yes, of you Lord. tonight. I challenge you to sow the seed of $40. I'm telling you, there are 10 of you tonight. I challenge you to sow the seed of $40. I ain't got no gimmicks or no tricks. I'm not going to ask you yes, to sow so I can prophesy. No. I, I said what the Lord said, but the Lord just spoke to me. If there are 10 of you tonight, you can sow that seed of $40. Hey. I'm oh, telling God. you, don't yes, miss God. this move. I yes. feel a release of God on me tonight. I'm telling you, there are 10 of you that can sow that seed of $40. Do it by faith. Yes, I'm Lord. Telling you, I'm telling you, I literally see miracles, signs, and wonders happening. I'm yes. telling you. I, I'm telling you. My God. <laughs> if y'all yes, if y'all can, can only see what I see. I'm, I'm a living witness. Sow that seed of $40. <laughs> Apostle has sold into my ministry before. And I'm telling you, miracle signs and wonders have yes, happened. They have. Testimonies have yeah. happened. I'm telling you, this I don't do this for play. Mm -mm. I do this because God told me to. I'm yes. telling you, there are 10 of you tonight. <clears throat> there are 10 of you tonight. I challenge you to sow that seed of $40 tonight. I'm not going to beg you. I'm not going to guilt you. Yes. I'm not going to do all that. I'm not going to pump and pump. You. The 10 of you, you know who you are. She said, my cash app is pinned below. I'm telling you, you need to jump into this river. There's a river open. Yep, no, no, no. Also, there's a river open. I'm telling you. As I see those two wings spread it up over ah! you, the Lord, the Lord said, I'm releasing a protection. Said, I'm releasing a protection that yes, no Lord. evil shall come now your dwelling. Hey, God. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I, I, don't, I, don't know who your, I don't know who your covering is. But I see God blessing your covering with a new building. Uh oh, see some keys. See yeah. some keys in a building. Mm -mm. And I, li I, I yeah. literally see that's I see I a rebrand. Oh. Confirmation. Yeah. Confirmation. My God. I'm, I'm going to tell, like tell you this. I'm going to tell you this. We're going to talk about that again. Uh huh. Down, we're going to talk about it. We're going to, uh, uh, we're going, down the line, we're going to talk about it. I see. I see God. Ah! Oh, glory. Yababa Sheko. Yes, Lord. I see, I see purple. I see purple in the church. I see purple chairs. Purple carpet. <laughs> But it's 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 it's. I gotta get up on there. It's 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 okay. I see purple and gold. That's that's my God. Ah ah yes Lord. Ah yeah, my God. First Peter two, First Peter two nine says, "Ye are a chosen generation." Yes Lord. Here's where the purple comes in: a royal priesthood. Yes Lord. I, I, okay, they're telling y'all like so they see the photo because there's a river open. And I, if I stay in there any longer, all right, come on, y'all talk, y'all do something. Yes, Lord. Because I feel, I feel mm -hmm. the anointing of revival on me. I feel the Pro anointing of Pro revival. It needs to be a revival to break out on this side because a lot of people have been stagnated, uh, man of God, and that word that you released. And that's what the Father put in our spirit for to bring you forward, to shift our minds yes. and unlock some things and break some things off of the people because they feel as though the Father is not with them because of transition. Glory. They feel as if the Father has left them 
out in the wilderness and it's not even a wilderness season. You're just in your transition. I'm going to quote my brother. I got a brother of mine. You know him, Apostle Ross, a prophet Griggs. I'm going to quote him. Oh, yeah. He, he says, what is not warfare, it's just transition. Yes, come on. Yes. Good. So, so, so many of you all are not in warfare, you're just in transition. Come on. Whoa. That's a word. That's a word. So, to, so tonight, I bless you. I bless you all. I bless your ministry. I bless you for the doors that God are about to open for you in Georgia, New York, and Florida. <laughs> I even I even bless God for the sons and daughters that are coming. <laughs> it's a few of them out here tonight. The sons and daughters, that, the new ones. Not no disrespect to the ones that you got now, Woo! but the new ones. That, that's the new ones. But it's then all over. There are some that left. I didn't need to come back. Uh oh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. There, are, there are three of them in particular that left. Three in particular that left. But they got to there's a river open. Listen, I, I got, I'm going to release the rest of this to y'all privately. So, we'll, we'll talk. But I bless God for y'all. Bless God for y'all ministry. Bless God for y'all life. And, you know, I, I don't know what to say. Y'all talk, please. Cause... <laughs> when, when the father told us to yes, bring you on. Yes. Mm -hmm. He told us also what was going to happen. Yes. He said, mindsets will be shifted. Yes. He said, yes, he said, babies will be leaping. Yeah, come on here. This, My this, God. He said, will be leaping. Yes, Lord. My God. Mm. 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 Especially them dumb ones that be laying dormant. <laughs> Prophet. There is a supernatural opening. Yes, Lord. A supernatural yes. opening yes. that's going on right now in this life. Yes, Lord. My God. And I'm telling you, I would say this about 80%. Yes. About 80% what the Father told you. He had already told me, but he told me not to release it. My God. He said, don't release it. My God. People of God. My God. God has spoken on tonight. Yes, he has. Hallelujah. Let me tell you this, prophet. And I said this several numerous times when we was on live, when I was on live by myself. Look, we don't play with people. Mm -mm -mm. We don't play with people's souls. We yes, more yes. we more concerned about their souls yes. than anything. Yes. Hallelujah. And God has spoken. Yes. Minds have been regulated on tonight. Yes, Lord. Babies have been leaping on tonight. Yes, Lord. My God. And I hear the Holy Ghost say this is just the beginning. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. He Hallelujah. said this hey. is just the beginning. Hallelujah. And I'm not finna, I'm not finna let the cat out the bed, but we're gonna meet again, prophet. That's it. Face to face. We're gonna yes. meet again. Yes, Lord. It's not going to be long. Yes, Lord. We're going to meet again. Yes, face Lord. to face. Yes, Lord. Woo, Shonda, Hallelujah. But there, I'm telling y'all, people of God, I'm telling y'all, there's an opening in the heavens. Yes. Hallelujah. There's an opening. Yes, Lord. I see it, prophet. Maybe not the same thing you see, but I'm seeing an opening and there's a bright light coming out there. Mm. Yes, God. My time. Oh. People of God, do not miss your due season. Right. Come on. Don't miss it. Come on. That's it. Don't miss it. Because you being hard-headed. Everything <laughs> that the Father has spoken through the man of God. Yes. The, the Holy Ghost gave us strategic instructions. Yes. yes he has. Don't y'all miss it. 
Hallelujah. Because I heard the Holy Ghost say for a few of y'all, this your last time. Uh oh. My God. My God. Last time. My God. My God. Jesus. Oh, my God. My God. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Don't miss it. Don't miss what God is saying. Don't miss it. 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 I pray. I pray that y'all don't miss it. Don't take this word for granted. That's it. This is just not a word. This is a seed that has been planted. Thank you, Lord God. Yes, this Lord. was a seed. Yes. Hallelujah. That has been planted. Yes, Lord. And you know who you are on this line. Come on. Come you on. know who you are. Come on. I'm telling you, the Lord has already told my Come wife on. and I before the man of God has spoken. That's it. That's it. Why y'all? Why some of y'all don't hear tugging and pulling on the man of God? Uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. See, let me tell y'all. Uh -uh. Let me tell y'all uh -uh. something about him. He's very authentic, authentic, and he ain't no crystal ball. See, don't come on here thinking that you're gonna pull a prophecy out of uh -uh, him because uh -uh. many of y'all have already gotten prophecies. Yeah. But you don't get too hard headed. Woo! You you have not listened. You and you still running out the prophecy after the prophecy. You haven't even completed the first prophecy that the Father has released unto you. Mm. And he said, the doors are getting ready to close shut. And he gave the word on that. He banged it up with the word. People of God, this 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 opening is not eternal. Yes. It's the whole Shabbat. This, this opening, this portal, and I ain't talking about the, the demonic ring. That's it. Yes, Lord. There's a bright light. Hmm. I, I, I wish they could see what I see, uh, Prophet. If they be at the Father's feet, in time they would. There's a portal that's opening. That's opening. <laughs> yes. Y'all do good. not want to miss this. Yes, Lord. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Y'all don't want to meet. Y'all better take everyone. If you have to watch the replay, yes, uh, yes. watch it. Don't drag your feet in this season. Because I'm telling you all, I'm telling you all, God is going to speed this thing up. Yes, Lord. I'm, I'm going to say this to the both of y'all, and I'm going to exit the live because I feel the pool, and I'm not going mm -hmm. to. There's a relocation coming for y'all. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Don't let, the, don't let don't let the state out the bag. Right. Oh, I'm not. Two states back and forth. But God is gonna give you the God is gonna give you the grace to sustain both. And, and 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 it's like I see mm. one service on first and third in one state, then another service second and fourth in another state. My God. It's going to give you the grace to sustain. Yes, Lord. When you hear all your right. Holy Ghost. We're going to inbox. I'm going, all right? Yes, I'm not sir. being rude by getting off, but... Oh, no, 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 no. I just, we understand. When the right. grace lifted, we understand. We're going to keep you Gra cashing until we log off, sir. Grace and peace. God bless you. God bless, God bless you. you. We love you. Thank you so much. I, I accept. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wow. My God, on tonight... Oh my God. Wow. If y'all have not got a greater understanding of why the Father is shifting the church back into alignment, he's getting us from being so comfortable, complacent, and lazy. And I'm going to say it lazy. Get off our soapboxes, get in the face of the Father. So you will know where your next move will be in this hour, in this season. It's too many of us in the body of Christ that's still out of order, still holding on to old things, old people, old ways, old mindset. And the Father is not moving. He's not going to open up your new door when you still have old things still opening. It's very easy to just let it go. But because you allow the enemy to continue to talk in your ear Jeez. and tell you that, this ain't your season. God ain't talking to you. You ain't no evangelist. You ain't no prophet. What did the Lord say in this hour concerning Jesus. you? Hallelujah. 
Hallelujah. We cannot continue to drag our feet. If the Bible said write the vision and make it plain, hallelujah, upon tablets, because the vision is going to speak and, and not lie. lie, hallelujah, and it's going to come forward in this hour and this season. I'm telling you, men of you got to know the season that you are in. Men of y'all going to miss it because you're trying to push yourself in a season that you ain't authorized in. My God. Some of you are trying to push through your process too fast. Mm. And the Father is telling you to slow down, pump Ooh. your brakes. All of y'all can't move at the same time. The Father is sending out, hallelujah, each platoon. If you know anything about the military, they got certain platoons that the Father placed them in. Ooh. And if your platoon ain't ready, and I mean all of y'all on one accord, the Father is not going to release you. Hallelujah. We can't go out there by ourselves without our platoon. That means the one that covers you, hallelujah, your leader, and those that the Father has placed under that leadership. Hallelujah. You cannot go before your time, hallelujah, because see, the enemy is waiting. He's waiting on you to step out of bounds. He's waiting on you to step out of your anointing. He's waiting on you, hallelujah, to go back to your vomit so he can go and accuse you because he is the accuser of the brethren. He's standing before the Father, telling the Father, if I like he did, Joe. He said, if I put this plague upon them, yeah, if yeah. I come up against them, watch they deny you, Father. Ooh. Watch they deny your name. Watch they go back to your vomit. Watch, Father. Hallelujah. So you got to make the enemy out of a lot in this hour. You need to close off all these doors. You need to shut down the unauthorized voices that continues to speak in your ear. And the one that's speaking, it got to be either you or, or, or the or enemy. enemy. Yes, or boss. yes. We got to know God's voice in this hour. Yes, come on, Pastor. And shut down every unauthorized voice yes. that's causing your babies to miscarry. Ooh, glory. Men of you, the Father has already taken your spirit out of a particular region Ooh. and already thrust your spirit forth. So you got to know how the spirit operates. Y'all looking at too much of your flesh. You, you looking at, oh, your now season. Oh, what do I see now? But the Father said, your now doesn't conform to what I got for your future. He said, does not compare to what I have for your future. You got to get in the position in the spirit realm and stop looking at your natural perspective. Hallelujah. Ooh. It's time to shut down this flesh and get before the Father and see, Father, what season am I in? I don't understand, and the Father yes. ain't going to yes. reveal everything to us. Yes. Remember, the teacher is always silent yes. during testing season. Ooh. That's good, Apostle. The teacher is always silent during testing season. And if you keep on having to repeat these tests, repeat. Guess what? The father gonna have to replace you. He gonna have to replace you, and he got to bring forth another. You think the father gonna wait on you till you get? Well, Lord, I gotta get myself together. Well, Lord, I don't have the necessary funds. There is no faith. Oh. Faith without works it's is dead. dead. It's dead. How you saying you operate by faith? Hallelujah! And you don't even trust your own process. Woo. You don't trust your process. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Father is literally want us to walk in our supernatural, yes. but because we all keep having a natural experience, oh my God, the doors of your spirit huh, was getting ready to close. Jesus. When the Father said, I have completed you, and you have depleted, okay, Yahweh, in the season that I have you in, but many of you are still trying to birth a baby in a dead season. Ooh. A season that he's already taken you out of. Many of you that are in regions that the Father had already shifted your spirit man out of, you still trying to produce in that dead region. Ooh. Why are you sitting in that region and the Father, he got us sitting because he wants to reset. He want to do a reset. Right. We get right. ready to go over into our season, our new years, hallelujah, of young Kapoor. Yeah. He's getting ready to reset us for this next year, this new season that we get ready to you. And we as people of God do not need to constantly miss out on our season because the process is too long. 
Because of the oil that's on your life, it has to be pressed down. Right. It has to be pressed. Yes. It has to yes. be pushed yes. to, uh, to uncomfortable places. God. Don't be like the children of Israel, mumbling and complaining in a season. Oh, hallelujah. That God did already shift them out of. Jesus. But because he had to test the children of Israel, hallelujah, because he's not going to just give us the promised land. Oh, no, no, no. That's too easy. He got to be able to trust you right. in this season. This is why your finances is getting hit. Because he got to test you in your finances. What are you going to do in this season when your finances are under attack? What are you going to do in this season, my title will say, when your mind is under attack? What are you going to do in this season when your body is under attack? Are you going to lay there in your pity party and tell the Lord, what was me? I can't do it, Lord. No, what I'm going to do is say, Satan, get thee behind. Maybe because you're asking the wrong questions. 
Stop asking, oh God, give me this big home. Oh God, give me, I need this platform. Oh God, raise me up so I can be like Juanita Bynum. Guess what? Whoa. Juanita Bynum don't even have the glory on her anyway. Yes, I'm gonna say it. Jesus. The glory has to part it. But Jesus. many people keep wanna be like one. I want Juanita Bynum to lay hands. I want T.D. Jace to lay. All your big platform people is about to take a back seat because he's raising up those that have his truth seal. The one that pours the oil for real, for real. In this hour, in this season, he is not playing. We don't look like the church. We don't talk like the church. We don't walk like the church. Just like the man of God said, give me a pair of jeans and a shirt. Give me, give me my, yeah. give me my Air Force One. Let me go walk the streets. I've been out there. Why are we so scared to go and do the will of the Father? Because He said, if they chastise me, they're gonna chastise you. Right. But He also told us that greater works we shall do. That's right. He said, That's I right. have left you the Comforter, the, the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. So therefore, if the Holy Ghost is giving you strategic instructions, that does mean that you shouldn't go before the Father. Jeez. Don't just push your own self out there because you're looking for a platform. Don't just push your own self out there because you know you are anointed. You got to ask yourself again, is this my season, Father? Jesus. Is this the hour for me to release? Is this the hour for me to sit back and glean? Is this the hour for me to sit back and just be a student yeah. just for a season? Why is it so hard that everybody wants to be seen in this hour? And while everybody else out here chasing the 99, guess what? Me and my husband already told the Lord, we'll get that one back there that was left. That one? That one that was left, that, 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 that's lagging behind. Look, we'll go back and get that one. And we'll sit with that one and we'll teach that one. We'll Jesus. push that one. Because everybody want to run after the 99. Hallelujah. You got so many leaders out here that scatter in the sheep. They don't know if they're coming or going. They don't understand why so much warfare is hitting their home. I'm just like the man of God said, it's too much dirty hands out here in this, right. in this hour. It's too much dirty hands. It's time for us to get a washing again, a cleansing. It's time for a purification in this hour and this season. If you can't shift, when the when the Father says shift, you ain't ready. I'm gonna need you to ready. stay on the porch, or I'm gonna need you to stay back there and be a medic to those wounded soldiers when they come out the front line. We're looking for some real front line runners. Hallelujah! Yes. It's gonna run this race. Yes. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! We ain't looking for them ones that say, oh, you know, I'm tired. You know, I can't, you know, I can't do it. Oh, it ain't enough money in that. Uh, uh, you know, I, you know, I can't, you know, I can't do it. No, because he said we are all a part of the body of Christ. We play a part in, in all of this. Right. We each got a part. And if those parts and pieces don't come together like a puzzle, we're going to continue to remain lost in our order. Jesus. We're going to continue to remain lost and out of order. Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So we got to obey the Father in this hour and this season, even when he don't give you the full instructions. That's right. If the Father is not speaking to you to release something, what that means? That means don't open your mouth. Right. Is the Father telling you to pray for this particular person? If he ain't, if that's not your assignment, see, oh my God, I'm not gonna go to Yahweh. Many of y'all are picking up assignments that the father never told you to pick up. Oh my God. Oh my God. Many of y'all are taking on unnecessary warfare because you're trying to pick up any and everybody. Trust me and hear me, hear me by the Holy Ghost. The father will tell you if that person or persons are your, are your assignments. And he's going to give you specific instructions. And if these people don't want to, they, they, don't, they don't want to comprehend what the Father is saying, let them go. Hallelujah. Dust your feet off and let them go. He said, what did he say in the Bible? If you come into a, a person's home and if they don't receive you, dust your feet off. Dust your feet off. In this hour and this season, we are not dealing with a veil of our spirit. We're not dealing with an orphan spirit. We're going we're gonna to allow the Father to deal with them because guess what? We are not the burden carriers. The Father carry all burdens. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Because like the man of God said, we are too distracted in the body right. of Christ. Right. We are too distracted. And now we got to realign our focus. 
and make sure that we are not missing even the small details. Hallelujah. Jesus. Y'all got Lil Wayne and, and Beyonce on your, you know, you, if the Father is calling you to that marketplace, go. then go. Go, yeah. If it's not your assignment, you need to redirect your focus. Stop keeping God inside of a box. Some of, these, some of this stuff right here is religion doctrine that's been taught yeah. out of era right, that needs to be broken. Yeah. And that's our number one warfare is religion. Hallelujah. But because we don't bring forth um, the word all the time, let me tell you something. The Father can revelate you from the third heaven with scripture. Yeah. I don't necessarily got to have a Bible in front of me all the time reading from scripture because I hear the Holy Ghost. I got the Holy Ghost. Yeah. I do what I do what the, my father tell me to do. Hallelujah. And I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna add to it, and I'm not gonna take away from. I'm raw and real. I'm raw and real with the father. If he tell me to release something, guess what? I'm gonna release it. If it make your head hurt, you'll be all right. It's willing to go down in the morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We got to bring forth you, you, you just what I, the father chastising those whom he loves. Yeah. If you are not being chastised by the father, that means you on the other side. Uh oh. Uh oh. That means you on the enemy side. If you're not being attacked, that means you on the enemy side. I got to question that. I question it. I question it. You mean tell me the enemy ain't doing nothing to you? Oh, okay. 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 That, 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 mean, that means you you on the wrong side of the That's fence. Right. We can't be lukewarm in this hour. You're going to be hot or cold. Stop following the crowds. Right. right. Stop following any and everybody. It's, it's, it's okay to take a break from social media. It ain't going nowhere. It's okay to take a break to, to, to get your body. Because I'm telling you, when this thing really pop off in the earth realm, you're going to need as much as strength as you can. You're going to need as much strength from the Father yes. as you can get. Yes. Yeah. This is why some of us got to come off of Facebook and he's got people on sabbaticals. Mm -hmm. He's pulling people off to go into the cave. He's pulling people off, hallelujah, for a reset to, to go into the chamber. Yeah. Yeah. But it's for a season. Oh, Lord. You have to be processed. It's, it's necessary for this process and it's necessary for you to complete this process, for you to come out done. That way, when you get ready to go out there, when you when you when he send you out on an assignment, they're gonna know. You ain't gotta make no announcement. Oh, I'm apostle so and so. No, when the oil show up, demons gonna start trembling. Right. When the oil show up, healing gonna take place. Did you see Jesus have to open up his mouth and say, "Oh, I'm the prophet that was sick here by y'all"? No, mm -mm. no, mm mm. Mm -mm. Your oil and your fruit going to make the announcement for you. There you go. They're going to know that you've been in the face of the Father. Hallelujah. By how you speak it, how you carry yourself. Listen, the remnant is the set apart. We don't look nor talk like the church. Right. right. Hallelujah. 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 So, you got anything to say there? Only thing I got to say is, um, the only way you're, going, you, you're not going to miss this move of God, you must flow with his spirit. Come on here. Yes, Lord. You only do, watch mm -hmm. this, you only do what he tells you to do. Yes. Mm -hmm. the, yes, Lord. That's just his play. That's the instruction. You only do what the Father tells you to do. Yes, Lord. If he don't tell you to do anything, Come don't on. do it. Come on. Come on. Right now, what the Father is doing, we cannot mm. walk in rebellion. Come on here. We cannot do extra. No, uh oh, uh oh. What's my saying, dear? I don't do extra. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> and I don't do overtime. See, in this season, <laughs> in this season, for some of y'all, y'all ain't got to deal with no more unnecessary uh, that's warfare. It. That's right. That's right. When you flow with his spirit, come on. You do what he tells you that's to do. Right. You're not going to miss it. Let's get rid of the dead weight. You better walk your home. Hallelujah. Clean out your homes and anything that, that's been sitting dormant in your homes that the Father been told you to get rid of those that he done told you to disconnect from. Yeah. If you still got things yeah. that belong or or or, or 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 that looks 
like them, get rid of it. So yeah. you got to do a natural cleansing. Yeah. And you need to do a spiritual cleansing. We done already spoke this numerous of times. Numerous of times. Well, I'm not seeing the Father doing this and that. Do you know what season you in? Well, everybody getting sudden this but me. Do you know what season you in? If you don't know, go and seek the Father. Right, right. Stop seeking a man. Right. And when I say man, I'm talking about male or female. Right. Apostles, prophets, there you go. whoever, whoever. Go see the father. A prophet is to bring confirmation. Huh? He did that. And that's exactly what he, the man of God did. He, brought, he brought forth confirmation. He brought forth what you already know that the father done told you. We got to get in alignment, people. I'm telling you, this thing is getting serious. Yes. The clock is winding up. We don't have time to play with people, demons. We don't. We just don't have time for that. The Father is moving quickly. He's giving yes. some of us Kairos moments. Yeah. Not Kronos, but Kairos. It's a difference. Right. He ain't sending you back. He ain't sending you to go backwards. No, no, no. But he wants to speed some of us up, but because of the mindset, but because what we've been taught, but because we're holding on to dead weight, and I do mean uh, church members, family members, um, I don't care who it is. Yes, Lord. Get rid of your dead weight. Yes. Well, Apostle, if I get rid of any more people, I'm going to walk alone. Good. That way you will be able to hear the Father even more. Hallelujah. You and him until he release you. Why God, Jesus. Walk alone so you can hear him clear, so you won't second guess yourself. Hallelujah. Well, I just, you know, I'm trying to understand. Some things is not to be understood. Hallelujah. Like my husband said, flow with his spirit. Flow with his spirit. That's, that's what God is saying. Flow with his spirit. That's what God is saying in this season. Do exactly what he tells exactly. you to do. Exactly. Don't do nothing extra. Come on. If he tell you go to fast for seven days, Come on. go to fast for seven days. Come on. If he tell you to pray for this person, Come on. you pray for that person. Come on. Hallelujah. Everything you do, you must do it in order. Come on. Yes, you got Lord. to do it in order. Thank you. That's Lord. the only way you're not going to miss it. Yes, right. That's Hallelujah. the only way you're not going to miss it for those who just came on. The man of God, that's his cash out. That's not my wife's cash out. I need the mind. Yes. That's the man of God who just poured out the word of the Lord. To Hallelujah. Him. Go back my and God. watch the replay. <laughs> that's a, go back and watch it. Go back. Go back. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. And and, 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 and the Father's going to release us to bring forth more teaching. Yes. Uh, the Father has been put, placing on me and my husband hard to open up Bible study to those that would like to come and join us in Bible study. Yes. Um, whenever my husband posted on, on his Facebook page yes. um, for us to gather uh, by way of Zoom or yes. Yes. whatever platform the Father have us on, you know, if you guys would like to join it, you know, just reach out to us when my husband get ready to release that information, but the Father has not released us yet. Right. Um, and there's other things that the Father uh, want us to do in this hour, but we can't move until the Father right. releases us. Right. It's not just going to be me teaching. <laughs> All right. It's not just going to be me, y'all. No. It's going to be some of y'all on this It's going to be some of y'all on this Yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Uh, Hallelujah. The grace has lifted off. Yes. Of yes. Well, we praise God once again for this opportunity. Blessings to the prophet. Yes, Lord. We'll release the word. My Lord. God, God bless you, Hallelujah. man of God. Prophet Isaac Rose yes, Lord. the second. Yes. Hallelujah. And he's on Facebook. If anybody would like to follow his Facebook yes, page, yes, Hallelujah. Yes. Um, he he just don't do the play Facebook platforms. He also, you know, you would like for him to come out to your local churches yeah. to minister the word. Just inbox him, and he will be gladly to give you that information to reach out to his assistants. Yes. Um, awesome, pure man of God. Love the Lord, and he loves people. Yes. So till next time, y'all, God bless you. Sweet sleep on tonight. Yes. We give the yes. glory, Amen. all the glory back to the Father. Hallelujah. And, Hallelujah. and we always say this before we get off the line. Everything that was said on here, please take it back to the Father. Take no it matter back to what. The Father. Take it back to the Father. We love y'all. God bless y'all. Many more oh, blessings and grace and peace yes, to you all. Yes. Until next week, we got y'all covered on next week. Hallelujah. To God be all the glory. We love y'all. Good night. Good night.